All right, here we want to uh, look at this problem, review exercise 12. So a group of chicken eaters was surveyed and asked to record their chicken consumption for a year. The following are the amounts of chicken consumed in the year measured in pounds for the sample. Use a histogram and normal probability plot to determine if this data can be modeled well with a normal distribution. See if you can do this on your own. Press pause now. Okay. So oftentimes we're interested in looking at a data set to see if it's going to be normal or at least can be approximated well by a normal distribution. So I'm going to clear out some stuff here. I'm going to go to Stat Edit. And if I have some things in here, I'm going to clear them out. That was probably the right data, but I'm going to clear it out. And then I'm going to type in some data. So I'll just type it in like this. 57, 69, 63... 49, 80 and 73 all right so we might count the data look at the data and then we have it in there so now I'm going to quit uh, just just for uh, looking at this I'm going to do some summary statistics go to stat right arrow to calc one variable statistics for list one leave frequency last blank do calculate and there we go and you can see the mean and standard deviation of the sample Okay, 67.125, standard deviation of the sample is 11.11. And so there's our mean and standard deviation of the individual. So if it's normal, it should be, that should be the mean and standard deviation of the, the closest normal to this. Okay, now if this was stuff was from a normal, let's see what, what it should look like. So let's go to stat plot, and I'm going to go to number one. I'm going to turn it on, and I'm going to choose... The histogram shape, which is right here, the end of the first li line. And I'm going to choose my X's from list 1, frequency 1. So I'm going to quit. I'm going to do a zoom 9, which is zoom stat. Okay. And it graphs the distribution. Now we look at that and we say, well, you know, that's, that's not looking exactly like a normal, but it's not that far off. Uh, it also depends a little bit about how they group them, uh, but this is with their default grouping. Uh, but at least we don't see anything too crazy. We don't see a crazy outlier. We don't see it really heavily skewed. It's a little skewed to the right here on this picture, but you know, not not too bad. So this might be possibilities. So it might might be a possibility. Um, now, if we um, look at the, we might made a better graph to see this. Well, one way we can do this is with a normal probability plot. So we go back to our stat plots and uh, let's turn that one off. Or just use it, but let's let's change the kind. So this one, now we're going to change the, the, the uh, kind to this very last one. That's a normal probability plot. And uh, I think I want <clears throat> the data from L1, I think I want the axis, the data axis to be Y, and then the X will be the uh, the Z scores, and put the mark. And again, if I do zoom 9, it should graph it. Okay, so there's what our graph looks like. Okay. So the question is, what? how do you interpret that? Well, you interpret that by saying, okay, if it's nearly a straight line, then it is uh, then the original data is nearly normal. If you see a definite curve, you know concave up or concave down to it, uh, then then that's a that's problematic. Then it's not normal. So it looks like from that that it's pretty close to normal. <laughs> so there are some of the screenshots from what I just did, and so uh, well it's pretty close. So we will say that this uh, <coughs> could be modeled pretty well with a normal distribution with mean 27.125 and standard deviation 11.111.
So that normal distribution would fit the data yeah, pretty well. So there's a good chance it came from something like that. So a normal probability plot, and to a lesser extent the histogram, gives us a way to tell if that data uh, could have come likely from a normal distribution. In this case, the answer is, yeah, good chance, because this is nearly in a straight line. Not going to be perfect, even if it came perfectly from normal, uh, but it should give us something that's reasonably close.